What's going on, his squad? That's your main man, Hitman, and I am back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all luxury, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tear cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Sunday. June 13th and as I say each and every video smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way and if you're watching just browsing just checking out the channel just checking out the cycles just checking out me in general make sure you guys subscribe and hit that notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day I also do live streams and stuff like that from time to time not always on red dead but on other videos this is a gaming channel not just a red dead channel so keep an eye out for that kind of stuff join talk to me and all kinds of other things i will try to talk back if i can see the comments um if you guys want to know Madame Nazara's location any bit earlier than this video, make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter at HitmanMiyagiYT. How to spell that will be in the description box below. It will, or also, it'll be in the left hand corner, the, the left hand bottom corner of the screen. I gotta make sure I say all of that to pinpoint exactly where it is. <laughs> but it's down in the bottom left hand corner of the, the screen. Um, and it's in a hashtag below the video. First things first, let's get Madame Nazara's location out the way, which everything is over here on the, the right side of the map. I like that. Right here, well, Madame Nazara's location is right here, right above the word Blue Water Marsh, right next to the elimination series over here. I don't know which one that is exactly, but she's right here and she will be right here until... 2 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone, for those of you who don't know or not of America. How I personally get to her when she's in this location is I'll simply just fast travel to LaGraw. LaGraw? It should put you around this area somewhere, like around here, I think, maybe. Like around here, right here. And I just run, take a beeline directly to her situation. <laughs> Or I'll just fast, I mean, uh, run from my moonshine shack. I don't think that's too far of a run. If you own a good horse and you got the good stirrups and stuff, she's super quick to get to. And then I'll just use my wilderness camp to get out of there and go back to where I need to be. But that's where she is today. And as I said, she will be here until 2 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. New York time zone, East Coast time zone, for those of you who don't know or not of America. Um, let's get to the next thing, which is the Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle, which is the Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle for today is right outside of Van Horn. So if you want to, you can run up from Madame Nazar's spot to there or fast travel to Van Horn. And it's right here where my waypoint is, which is right outside the eye that's over here. If you do come over here in this area, there's a, I guess a eye that's in, in the ground or made out of rocks or something like that, where I guess maybe somebody made it there. But there's a outlook or a overwatch post. You have to climb up the ladder. There's a platform, climb up the ladder again. There's another platform. I don't think there's three levels, but if there is, go all the way up to the top, the very top level, and that's where you will get your Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle. Let's go down here to where we normally do business. I'm gonna try to get everything in frame, which I don't think I can. No, I can't without making stuff go away. Anywho, up there is not as important as the stuff down here. Well, all of it is equally as important. Let's not say that. But anywho, the cycles for today, Sunday, June 13th, are Family Heirloom Cycle 6, 
All Lost Jury Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 5, Arrowhead Cycle 2, Wildflower Cycle 2, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 5, All Tarot Card Cycle 2, Bird Egg Cycle 2, and Fossil Cycle 3. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The cycles, a link to a video, and the, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel because it will be down there as well. Um, let's get to these things that we will find across the map. I do have one or two that I did not mark that I know for sure that I want to tell you guys about. But let's start up. There's a lot of things inside of Van Horn, like around this whole little area, by the way. So there's a whole lot of things like all, all around this little area right here, especially like this R. There's about two or three things over here. I know there's a, like a card here. I won't tell you these. I'm gonna just go through these real quick. There's a family heirloom that you have to dig for, I think, over here by the R. So come over here with your metal detector. Over here by this area, there's a arrowhead. This arrowhead, that's a dig spot, so you don't have to uh, use your metal detector for that. Um, there's a coin down here near this dot, I think. I guess it's the house right here, like near this area. There's a coin down here. And then uh, there's a flower here. There's a card here. I think it's inside the house. I can't really tell you guys yes it's on the taxidermy table there's a a lost jury here if you guys want to get that back here there's a card another card over here you have to come over here with your metal detector right there at that location and there's another family heirloom that's a metal hair pin. and i mean it's a lot of stuff over here in this area along with the bottle that's right here you know so it's a lot of stuff over here if you guys want to go over there and collect and search and all that stuff just uh go through this area i mean it should help you guys out and you know try to pinpoint it on your map as i just went through it uh anywho let's start up here let's start again right here at this first marker right here at this location you guys will get Let's zoom in a little bit right about here you guys will get a fossil a random fossil i cannot tell you guys what fossil you will get because it is randomized so come over here with your metal detector i think it's around a tree or something like that so you know when you do come over here look for that use your metal detector and down here there's another thing, there's an antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is a scotch whiskey bottle. There's like a pile of rocks and you can reach your hand inside that pile of rocks. And that's what you would pull out, a scotch whiskey antique alcohol bottle. There's also like a broken down boat or washed up boat over here in this area. So that should help you guys on your journey or that your journey for that specific item. Um, there's a broken down outhouse right here with a tear cart around this area. I don't want to say exactly right here. It may be exactly right there. Um, there's a broken down outhouse with a page of cups tear card in it. Let's go. We're going to go all the way over here. Let's go right here at this location across the Kamasa River. If you guys can see that all the way over here. Right here at this location, super close to this square. Pull out your metal detector and you guys will get a random coin. This square is a moonshine uh, camp, stillery. Or there's, a, there's a stiller right here or whatever. But come over here with your metal, detect metal detector and you will get a random coin. There's also a card inside this house or this shack or whatever you want to call it on a stack of boxes that is a five of cups let's go across the water over here to our next marker right here at this location you guys will get a random arrowhead you do not need your metal detector for this one you just need your shovel it's right at the back end of this 
shack, I think there's a cart, like a wagon or something. Right behind that wagon, that's where you will find that little dig spot. Remember, you don't need your metal detector, but you do need your shovel. Let's go over to our next location, which is a lost jury. This lost jury is inside this house, right here at this location. And it's inside the chimney when you get to the house. So walk up to the chimney, you will see a prompt to search the chimney and you will pull out a Durant Pearl bracelet. And when this lost jury is here, there's one also right about there, right outside the house, there's a random lost jury. I cannot tell you which one you would dig up, but come around this big, tree that's over here in this backyard with your metal detector and that's what you will get let's go over to our right a little bit more to our next location there's a couple things over here i think there's a tear card over here somewhere and maybe a i think here right here inside this shack there's a four of wands tear card there's also a tarot card here. I don't know if people are actually looking for these tarot cards. There's a tarot card here as well. That tarot card is a eight of pentacles. But right here at this location of our next marker, you it's underneath this bridge. Come underneath this bridge with your metal detector and you guys will dig up another random coin. These The coins, they were the best money getter. I guess when a game first, the first couple years of the game before they switched everything up the coins were the best money getter if you were going to get anything every day you were going to get the coins <laughs> i mean that was my whole hunt but that's what that is at this marker right here um going down to the e in the moin right here right here behind this house or mansion or shack it's a it's a mansion right here there's a bench on that bench you guys will get a ebony hairbrush this ebony hairbrush is on the bench right at the back of the porch like right i wouldn't say the back of the porch right at the beginning before you get to the stairs or in the middle because there's a stairway here and there's a stairway here and like right there in front of the stairway there's a bench there's a bench there and there's a bench on this side you're looking for the one where the marker is Anywho, let's go over to the right a little bit more into the cemetery where you guys will find a, another tarot card. This tarot card is a Knight of Wands. So go and grab that. It's in the mausoleum right here where the waypoint points or the marker points right there at that location. Uh, let's go over. I have a couple family heirlooms to give or show you guys where they are right here across from Gus there's a treasure chest right inside this treasure chest you guys will find a boxwood comb there's when that's there there's also a tortoiseshell comb right down this alley so you come down this alley and on the ground floor you should see a bench over here to the side and on that bench you will find a tortoiseshell comb Let's go over here to our next marker, which is another family heirloom as well. This family heirloom is a carved wooden hairpin. It's in a pile of trash right here at this location, right in the little landfill area over here. So when you do come over here, pull out your metal detector and you will find it in a pile of trash. Our next marker is a, another fossil. This fossil is randomized as well as with all fossils and coins. But come over here in this little sewage uh, toxic area right here with the metal detector and that's what you will get, a random fossil. Our next marker is a antique alcohol bottle, another antique alcohol bottle. How to get this bottle is there's a cart about here. You jump on the first cart jump into the second cart, which looks like a very big playpen. And in one of the corners, you will find a antique alcohol bottle, which is once again, a London dry gin bottle. Over here to the left, you guys will find a bird egg at our next marker. 
This bird egg, this bird egg is a spoonbill egg. It's in a tree, so shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Let's go down to our next marker, which is a cardinal flower. This cardinal flower, this specific cardinal flower helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on for the day, which this is cycle two. Let's go over. I wanted to go over to make sure there was nothing here, but there's nothing really there. There's a coin right here next to this next to this um house this is this a uh, stranger mission there's a big tree right here at this location and right around that tree come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will get a random coin let's go up to roads for a little bit because i have a couple things up there as well uh there's a tarot card here on a bench at this location that's a four of cups and on the terrace that's the second floor right here at this location uh there's a little dining area and on one of those tables you guys will get a knight of swords tarot card but the last thing i have for you guys i think is right here at this location right at the corner of this building there's a treasure chest and in that treasure chest you guys will get a family heirloom which is a rosewood hairbrush open up the treasure chest and just grab it out but that's pretty much it for today i hope i gave you guys enough hints i try to give you guys a lot of um you know extra so you guys can get started on your journey but the cycles for today sunday june 13th are once again Family Heirloom Cycle 6, All Laws Jury Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 5, Arrowhead Cycle 2, Wildflower Cycle 2, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 5, All Terror Card Cycle 2, Bird Egg Cycle 2, and Fossils Cycle 3. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 6, All Laws Jury Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 5, Arrowhead Cycle 2, Wildflower Cycle 2, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 5, All Terror Card Cycle 2, Bird Egg Cycle 2, and Fossils cycle three remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there the cycle is a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell the twitter and instagram for the channel uh, as i say as i have been saying as i try to remember to say thank you guys for watching thank you guys for liking sharing commenting and subscribing i do appreciate each and every bit and if you don't if you haven't if you have not yet remember to like share subscribe hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that i put out because i put out videos each and every day <laughs> uh once again for another day it is your main man hitman make sure you guys watch out for any live streams or anything that i do do and join and talk to me you know give me some kind of something going while i'm playing these games if i go live so Keep an eye out for me. I may do something a little bit later. Maybe more Call of Duty. I don't know. If you guys are into Call of Duty, I do have uh, Dragon Balls here. Uh, Kakarot, they did another update, and I haven't played that. I can do that. Um, I don't know. G give me, Drop me suggestions in the comment section below. Any games you guys like to play, enjoy playing? uh would like to see somebody else play or want to see if i can get through it or you know something like that let me know what's going on if you guys want to do any co-ops or you know online plays or something like that i know um queen says she likes the gta gta has gotten kind of i guess the same so <laughs> I'm trying to wait for an update before I get back into GTA and stuff like that. But, you know what I'm saying? Let me know anything down below and I'll, I'll try to incorporate that into the channel and all kinds of other stuff. Anywho, that's enough for this video. I don't want to make it super long. Thank you guys for watching once again and I'm out.